match number six will be a game between two sides who are coming on the back of contrasting fortunes while we have Oman on one side who are coming on the back of a thumping 10 wicket victory against the Papua New Guinea on the other hand we have Bangladesh who were brought down on their haunches by the Scotland team. So this particular game will be played between a Bangladesh and Oman. Hello everyone, my name is Shayan Toshin Gupto and welcome back to another MSP video presented by TikToker. I hope you guys are doing fine but before I jump straight into the video, I would request all of you to like, comment and share. Also subscribe to our channel so that you never miss an update from us. So without further ado, let's quickly jump right into the video. <music> If we take a look at the probable playing 11 of the Oman team, then opening the batting will be Khawar Ali and Jatinder Singh. Jatinder Singh played really well in the previous game, followed by number 3 will be having Akib Elias, then the skipper of the side Zishan Maksud at number 4, followed by at number 5 will be having Kashyap Prajapati, then Nasim Khushi who will be the keeper of the team. Followed by Mohammad Nadim and the four bowlers in the form of Ayan Khan, Sandeep Goud, Kali Mullah and Bilal Khan. So that is the probable playing 11 of the Oman side. Now if you take a look at the probable playing 11 of the Bangladeshi Tigers, then opening the batting will be Shomo Shorkar and Litten Das, followed by the talismanic all-rounder Shakib Al Hassan, who played really well in the previous game, also became the highest wicket taker in T20 cricket, T20i cricket in the previous game, followed by number 4 will be Mushfiqur Rahim and the skipper of the team Mahamudullah at number 5. Followed by Afif Hussain and Nurul Hussain, followed by the four bowlers in the form of Mahadi Hassan, Mohammad Saifuddin, Taskin Ahmed, and Mustafa Zorayman. So there's a blend of experience as well as youth in the bowling department. Now, if you take a look at the head to head battle between both the teams, that both the teams, Oman and Bangladesh, have met only once in a World Cup game, and that game was won by the Bangladeshi Tigers. So the Oman team have not won a single T20I game against Bangladesh, and they'll be looking to better that game. If you take a look at the stadium in which this game will be played, then it will be played at the Al Amirat Cricket Stadium in Musket, Oman. The average first inning score over here is a 158 in the last five matches and the last five matches team that have chased have won on two occasions and have lost on three occasions. Now if we take a look at few of the individual stats and milestones in this game which can be looked after which can be actually uh, be some good achievements then if you take a look at Shakib Al Hassan, Shakib Al Hassan is just 37 runs away from completing 5,500 runs in T20 cricket, so that will be a huge achievement for him. Next, if we take a look at Mushfiq Rahim, Mushfiq Rahim is just five fours away from completing 400 fours in T20 cricket. Next, if we take a look at Shomo Shorkar, Shomo Shorkar is just 27 runs away from completing 3,000 T20 runs. And lastly, if we take a look at Aki Bilyas of the Oman cricket team, then he is just 42 runs away from completing 500 T20 I runs. So with that, we come to an end to this particular MSP video presented by Tracker. This was match number 6 between the Oman and the Bangladesh cricket team. I hope you like the content but before I go, I would request all of you to subscribe to our channel and also head to our Telegram channel where you'll be getting the best match combos as well as the best cricket fantasy tips. So without further ado, please do these things and stay home and take care.